Welcome back. I'm excited to share another one of my secrets today. And, and as I mentioned yesterday when we were talking, Harvey Penick was the foremost person in my mind in golf instruction to have studied the grip. I think he knew more about the grip than anyone that's ever uh, taught the game of golf. And it certainly became a passion of mine. And uh, since the years have passed since I was with him, uh, I've really continued to try to learn as much as I possibly could about the grip. And I want to share some of those secrets with you. During one of my conversations when we first began working together, I asked Harvey how you can really tell as a teacher if a person is placing their hands on the club correctly. I, I think it's so easy sometimes to just take the grip for granted, and I see a lot of teachers actually do that. Uh, the grip is something that most people think is boring, but it's your only connection to the leading edge of the club. It's your only connection to the club face, so it's incredibly important for us to understand. The simplest and easiest way was the advice that he gave me that day. He told me, Brian, he said, simply watch their, hand, or watch their forearms, not their hands. And by that, I want to show you what he meant there. It's just allowing the arms to hang comfortably from our side. We set the club down behind the ball, and notice how my left forearm just moves down onto the club nice and comfortably. From there, I just reach and shake hands with my right hand, and you can see that my forearms are very natural and very comfortable in the address position. That keeps the tension to a minimum, just like we were talking yesterday when we were discussing about the proper grip pressure. That helps me maintain my grip pressure. It helps me maintain the correct position. I think if you'll try letting those forearms get comfortable, allow your hands to move from the top down instead of the bottom up, as you'll see on my seven pillars video, I think you'll learn a lot from this segment. I look forward to talking with you again tomorrow, and we're going to talk about that special secret of clipping the tee and just exactly what that really meant.